hi there so in this tutorial I'm going to show you how you can generate PDF files with the help of PHP code so first thing we're going to do is we're going to download fpdf library by going to fpdf.org click on downloads link then you will find current version listed here as a zip folder then you go to your Apache server and here in folder you extract these files after that we open text editor I am opening sublime text and here we are going to write the code okay so let's start by typing PHP and then call for require fpdf.php okay then let's create an object pdf equals to new fpdf then another object here we are going to add the page okay now let's save this so that you can quickly edit changes so I'm saving this as PDF dem fpdf demo dot php okay now uh, it has page let's edit some properties like pdf and then set font okay let's give it aerial font And make it 18 keep the semicolon and then write something for first cell okay so on cell 40 10th column so that we are going to write this is FPDF demo by hub folder okay now let's ask to generate the output there are any errors it will be shown while executing the program so let's go to the web browser 127 okay then go for f pdf demo dot php this will create a pdf file if the code is correct if not then it will not generate the pdf file so right now it is not showing any pdf document in another tab that means there are some issues so let's take a look at our code is our program correct okay so looks okay to me so let's click here and check out if it managed to create a demo file Okay, so the problem was I have used equal sign where I'm supposed to use single dash so this was the reason it was not showing the output but now I'm sure it will show it again okay so let's go here and execute again and you'll find that it is showing me the PDF output now so it used cell number 
for T10 and output the message this is a PDF demo by help folder so this was simple example so, there are a few more things you can do for example you can get the database table and use PDF object to output this particular database table into PDF that way you can create reports for the data collected inside your PHP web application and that way you can also make complete projects for those database related apps okay so in future tutorials I will cover other exports like CSV Excel so I hope you find this tutorial helpful now see you next tutorial thank you